In some accounting and financial calculations, a 360-day year is used with each month being assigned 30 days. In Excel, the Days360 function returns the number of days between two dates based on a 360-day year. As an example of how to use this, in this worksheet, in cells A3 and B3, we have two dates. We're going to calculate the number of days between them and put the answer in cell C3. So we start by left-clicking on cell C3 so it is highlighted. Next, we type in an equal sign. And from here, we type in DAY, and a drop-down box will appear. In the box, we're going to left-double-click on Days 360. And from here, we need to left-click on the start date, in this case, cell A3. Next, we type in a comma, and then we need to left click on the end date, in this case, cell B3. From here, we type in a close parenthesis, and then hit the Enter key, and we have our answer of 30 days. And here is another example, going from 1, 1 to 1, 1. I have the function in cell C4, I'll hit the Enter key, and we have our answer of 360 days. All right, my friends, hopefully you got something out of this video. I do have sh sh more videos right there for you. Till next time, I am out of here.